All right, hey guys, it's Lyo here. Welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm gonna make another theory on the storyline so far and what we already know, giving you guys some theories on what I think will happen in the future. Now, I'm doing this as a live commentary, just playing the game here to show you guys anything I need to. I didn't anything after it, just talk it over. That's why I, I did a few of my live commentaries, so I'm gonna do this as well. I feel like it's better if I do it from here and just add in the clips if I have to later on. Just makes it easier for me and it comes out better in the end as well. I'm going to go into detail about the story, what we know so far, about the season, and then just go from there. I've been spending so much time on theories, which is why the video has been delayed. Literally all my time that I've not been making videos, I've been thinking about what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be saying for this theory video. I'm also going to be making the Blockbuster theory video, what I think that skin will be before it comes out. Stay tuned for that. Probably be soon after this. Anyway, let's get into it. So first I'm going to explain all the loading screens. So I don't have all of them yet, but I'm going to be showing the pictures of the ones I don't have. This is the one from week one. I think it was not a detail in it. We just saw the meteor landing and that was it. This is the one we got for week two. And the code is, I will reclaim my power. I will gather my allies. I will have my vengeance. Well, that quote right there is probably important. So stay tuned for that. I'll probably mention that later on. And the next one is a limiting threat. Once again, our heroes must unite and heed the call to action. And for week four, I don't have. But the week four is basically where... Omega skin or Omega, or if you want to be LA, you can call it Omega. <laughs> but the Omega skin, uh, it was basically just gathering up allies, making an army. I don't have the quote for it yet, but I'll just show the picture on screen. There's also have the one for this uh, week five, which is the one we got this week, which is a superhero fight between all the superheroes and villains. And the one that's going to be unlocked this week has already been leaked. And uh, it's basically just the superheroes on set, and the whole thing was basically supposed to make you think that it was all movie. But that doesn't really make sense, I'll get to what that later. And week 7 hasn't been leaked yet, because they want to seal it to the end probably, because they probably know people are going to leak it. So the smart move on them, same thing you should do for the Blockbuster skin, just don't put it into the game's coding just yet. Just wait for it to put a patch in to release it, because then everyone's going to leak it and they're going to find out what it is. They should try to hide it in some way, they got to find out some way to hide it, but I don't think they can, because you will find out everything in this game, so it's probably not going to work. But yeah, we're going to find that out in 11 days, and find out what the new Blockbuster skin is in 11 days as well. So we'll see for that, but I'm going to make assumptions on that later. So stay tuned for that video. Uh, and I'm not going to mention Blockbuster skin in, again in this video, so yeah. Things you should look for are the movie title changes, uh, the Risky Reels, movie theater sign, the driving sign, because they've been changing constantly. I don't think it's every week, but it's been changing constantly, so... It's changed at least three times that I know of. I'm not sure about the other ones, but these are pretty important if you can stay read them all. Maybe put them together, they might lead onto something. I haven't seen all of them yet, if there are more than three. But you gotta stay tuned for the three current ones, so you gotta bring into the story as well. One of the movie lines in particular are really important for the story, at least I think that's what it is. Because that could potentially lead on to season 5 story and what the theme could be. Which I'm also going to make a video on what the themes could be for season 5. Using detail and explain my theories. So hopefully that goes well and hopefully you guys like that. But stay tuned for that video. I'm not going to go off topic for this video. I want to make it short and sweet. It's not too long. Another thing you should look forward to are the superhero posters. Uh, if you didn't know, there's superhero posters posted around the map. I put a video on that. Uh, go check that out. A lot of carbide posters and a lot of Omega posters. Oh my, I said Omega. Turning into LA already. Omega posters. And they're just scattered around the map. But the thing about this is that they could be put in certain locations around the map. People are saying this is just to promote the movie that's been released. Because people are saying that this whole season was based on a movie theater. But it doesn't make sense because there's more than one theme for the season. It wasn't just superheroes and movie set. There's a lot more to it. There are still a lot of questions that aren't answered. And I'm going to be going over those questions later on in the video. But anyway, uh, the post people are saying the posters are for a challenge for week 6, which has been leaked. And some people have already gotten it already this week. But I don't think that's what all they're being used for. Sure, they could be used for promotional reasons for the movie, like I said. But I think that there's some sort of plot for this. Because in, around the map, they're put in a lot of specific areas. And I feel like this is going to result in some type of faction war or something. Because this will be a perfect time for them. Because I don't think all this... I don't think this season was just put in just for it to be fake. I think there's something involved here. There's no way Epic Games added in this storyline uh, just to make it fake at the end. There's... There has to lead up to something, in my opinion. I'm going to show you guys the postal locations. The idea that I've gotten is that the locations for these postals could mean something. Maybe we're in faction war. And these areas are owned for the certain faction. So Carbide could own Greasy Grove because his poster was there. Uh, Tilted Towers could be owned by 
Omega, because his poster was there. And there's never two posters in the same area. They're sure it could be just a challenge, but I think it's more to that. But I'll, I'll, I'll mention the poster later on. Anyway, let's go to the next one, which is the prison, where the prison's been destroyed, as you know. But in the prison, there's a bed with a tally on it, and it has eight on the tally. This tally is actually on every bed frame, which is probably either just... Which either means something important, or it's just lazy editing by epic because they just copy and pasted it but regardless this definitely has to do with something maybe this could be week eight week seven i'm pretty sure this is gonna be week eight because week seven we get the, the block pusher skin so after that there's gotta be something created for that because we don't know what this loading screen could be we know what the other ones are but they haven't leaked this one out yet so once they leak this one out this is going to be the ending of the block with your skin story i mean the storyline for season four and it's going to lead on to season five the next coming weeks because there's two more weeks after that i feel like week seven and eight are going to be really important for the story and then after that it's just going to lead on and we're going to have we're going to know what the story is for sure that's my opinion maybe we might find it the last day tally where it says eight has got to mean something maybe this is when the, the movie comes out Maybe we actually get a movie and we get like a secret tier on it. We honestly don't know what this could mean yet. So we're going to have to find out when it comes out. But well, next thing I want to mention on this video is the black cars by the Meteor. And all the Meteor creators are on the map. As you may know, they're, all, they're fixing up the map and they're patching up the creators. And the cars or the FBI Secret Service cars or whatever. I don't know what they are. The government, Fortnite, <laughs> Epic Games themselves, plot twist. Uh, basically, they've clean, they're cleaning up all the Meteors. All the patches and they're literally just moving but one thing i've noticed though is that all the cars are moving in the same direction and the first patched up was the one until the towers where they patched up and the cars are already on their way i want to show you guys in the background basically the cars have been all going in the same direction and basically the one at tilted towers is at the stadium right now and you could tell where it's going because it's moving the same path and there's only three positions it can go which is adding it to a lot of controversy but i'm going to explain my opinion on it first place it can go is obviously the missile and the villain lair, which I don't think that's the case. In my opinion, like a lot of people have been saying that. So there's, there's a lot of speculation that's going there, but I don't believe so. And the reason that is, is because the meteor was supposed to be for a movie set, right? Because it's in the background, there are scenes there. I feel like the meteor itself is going to be something used for alone. Maybe the, the hop rocks are going to be used for the meteor. They're going to steal that. Maybe the government's going to steal them. Which is, it's going to be a crazy theory. There's a lot of theories out there. Uh, I'm going to be going over more than one theory in this video. So that's one theory but another place it can go is a hidden road in the mountain to the left of the villain lair and there on the hill there's a house with a carbide skin on it with a poster i think this house is actually really important we didn't expect it earlier but i just feel like this house is really important it's got a poster on it there's got to mean something it has to have something significant on it i don't see why they would put a poster up there in that mountain so i feel like that's house is owned by someone important maybe it's going to be destroyed in the next season we don't know i honestly think we need to look into the house before this, the next week comes in because i feel like that's going to be changed somehow I don't know yet, but something will happen to the house most likely, at least in my opinion. And there's actually two more places it could go, but I don't think so. The next one is Snobby Shore, which uh, I, in my opinion, it could go here because week six of the Battle Pass challenges, the final image leads on to the Snobby Shore and the Hop Rocks are already on their way there in delivery. They're closed there. So they're going to be moving there in that area by next week. So it's going to be in the same area, the same time as that movie set. And that time in the movie set. So they could actually use those hot rocks in the movie. We don't know. Maybe that's how they're flying. And another thing that they, it could be is Haunted Hills. Because on the Risk Real Theater, it says the hills are haunted. So that could mean that Haunted Hills is actually haunted. There's something there. And I'll get onto that a little later. Maybe it's the missile. But one thing I've noticed, and it's also really close to Haunted Hills, is the, the media crater. Now, the, the cars around that media crater have been tipped over. Uh, and the hop rocks are gone. So this could mean that something had taken it. Maybe something big. They really knocked it over a monster. And that's what my theory is. There's, there's a monster in Fortnite right now. At the beginning of season four, the risky real sign said it came from Moisty Mire. And we don't know what it meant. It just said it came from Moisty Mire. And during the weeks, the media didn't really get anything. And then this week, we got uh, the, the hills are haunted and the cabin in Wailing Woods. Maybe this could mean that the cabin in Willing Woods was a place where this moisty monster was. Maybe the bunker has something to do with it. Maybe that bunker belonged to the monster. Like, this monster could have traveled really fast during the weeks. But honestly, like, we we have no idea what this could be exactly. Even with all the leaks coming, there's still no one has no clue. People have been making clickbait videos saying that this could happen, this could happen, even with the leaks. It's still clickbait, because even though it's leaked, this could be changed and it's not... 100% true. You can't just still call something legit when it's based on a leak. I've heard a story where the logo on one of the trucks in Tilted was the same as the one in the villain there, which I didn't really see. I don't think it's the same logo. I looked for the logo everywhere on the cars. I could not find it, so I 
thing that's kind of BS. Maybe I missed it, but I've looked a lot and I couldn't find it. Now, I took a video of an area that is in the water of a monster. Maybe this could be a sea monster or some random shade in the water. Random block. So this could be it. Maybe that's leading on to the, the game modes that are coming in the future that people have leaked out. Uh, potentially this could be the monster people were saying it's the leviathan skin it's gonna be a new game mode there's nothing that's guaranteed to happen in fortnite right now we don't know anything we're definitely gonna find out in the weeks to come uh it's still a mystery right now which is what this video is for just they're gonna talk going asking you guys what you guys think your opinion going over the storyline etc trying to figure out mysteries that are still in the game right now maybe this could lead on to the, the bunker because we have no idea what that could be it pushes on cars. This could be a monster, but it probably might not be. And there's a good chance it might not be. I may have missed something already, there, but if I do figure it out later, then I'll comment it down below and pin it. I'll also be hiding comments that I think are really good for this theory. Uh, some smart comments, so let me know what you guys think. Anyway, uh, let's go over what is still a mystery to us, and that is the meteor. Meteor has been breaking ever since it landed in Season 4. Definitely something in that meteor. It's something robotics, maybe a capsule of some sort. Maybe it could be an alien or monster people were talking about. It kind of looks like uh, R2-D2 in my opinion. If you look at it, maybe there's going to be a Star Wars theme, which would be really sick. Maybe that a Blockbuster skin could be Dark Vader. I'm not going to mention that in my Blockbuster skin video, just because it's a long shot and I just came up on the spot. But anyway, this just, like, we still don't know what that is. And not to mention, there's also still the Meteor Spy. Now, if you didn't know, on the mountain next to the Meteor, there's a chair with a telescope on it, and the telescope's aiming right at the Meteor. I honestly feel as though there's someone spying on it. There's something important that's going to be, that's going to be revealed later on. We don't know yet. This is still a mystery to us. We don't know who this is. This could be someone important for season five, but there's definitely someone spying on it and wants to be Meteor to come out. Maybe he's an alien as well. Maybe he's looking to take the whatever's in the meteor and take it for himself. We don't know yet. One thing theory I'm thinking about is whoever is spying on them is the owner of a house in Salty Springs. And the reason this is is because the mountain is really close to Salty Springs, and in Salty Springs there's a blue house with an underground base, a secret base. I honestly think that's his, it belongs to him. Maybe there's pictures on the walls of a person and that could be him. This place is almost guaranteed to be his house in my opinion. We still haven't had any information about what the house has to do with anything in the season. So if it has to do with anything in the season, it, I, in my opinion, it's gotta be this guy's house. Maybe next week he's gonna come out of hiding, kind of spying, and he's gonna take action and take over the meteor. Because the meteor might be open next week. It's definitely gonna be open a little more. Maybe we're actually going to know what it is by next week. We're going to go to Salty Springs right now and uh, trying to figure out what it is. So there's Dusty. So Dusty might be opened up by the end of this week. Uh, we have no idea yet. It might be because I might be able to try to take out the meteor out. Once they try to take the meteor out, this guy on this hill, as you can see right there, there's supposed to be a chair. There's literally nothing else here. So there's literally no point of coming up here. You can't have just put this area in the map for no reason. They're, I feel like they gotta use it for something. It hasn't mentioned any of the weekly challenges. It hasn't mentioned in the, the loading screens. Like someone's hiding, having a base here and we don't know what any of this does. Don't know what it does yet. So actually control the missile. A fake missile over there, but they didn't realize it's actually real. And that brings us to the next part, which is a giant missile, which could be powered up by the hot rocks. And as you can see, the hot rocks are supposed to be in here. You can't really see it, but they're supposed to be in there. And as you can see, there's only one path, like I said. You can tell it's turning. So it's not going to go left. And one thing I will say is that there's see the path. There's a hidden path over here. Goes up to the mountain. Or up to the house. We don't know yet. But anyway, as you can see, there's an ice cube truck blocking the path. Because it's still on the path, but it might not go there. It's probably not going to go there because of the ice cream truck on the path. The only road they can really take is like right here, but there's not a path to it. There's no way to actually drive up this. Maybe a secret entrance or something? I honestly don't think the hot rocks are coming to this uh, missile just because it was all a, a set and it was all shooting. But one thing I still don't get is that there, there's supposed to be a movie taken here with scenes and stuff, but the thing is, is that we don't have any cameras here. Like, sure, we have security cameras, but these are props. These aren't here to record actual scenes. There's, there is no cameras here, there's no green screen, etc. Next week for weeks, this is supposed to be cameras here and a green screen, which could be the actual location for this. Maybe there's like a secret place in one of these areas that we don't know about. Maybe right here, it's gonna be a secret entrance. I kinda want more underground areas for Fortnite. There's at least something that's gonna happen in this area because this is where the cars are coming. So it's, it's gotta mean something. Whatever it is, these black cars are definitely leading out to something. Because like I said, there's only there's not just one theme for Season 4. There's a superhero theme, there's a movie theme, and then there's an alien theme. And this could be maybe Area 51. These hop rocks are going to somewhere. Because these hop rocks are most likely going to be gone in Season 5. We were saying it's going to be a museum theme. Maybe people were saying it's going to be a Greek, uh, ancient mythology theme. We don't know. Now, I've been trying to piece this together, but if you guys have any suggestions, let me know. I don't have any other suggestions to add in. That's all the theories I have for this 
topic up itself but uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think uh this meteor is definitely going to play into part for something and if this meteor is the is used for nothing then it was kind of a waste yeah we kind of wanted to see some some stuff going down you know yeah that's pretty much it i don't have any other speculation to give like i looked over haunted hill i looked through all the areas and i couldn't find anything that I, that's worth discussing other than the things that i mentioned make sure you like subscribe and comment down below what you think is going to happen and let me know any theories that you have any things that i left out in this video make a discussion with you guys in the comments because i read all comments so don't worry and yeah that's it catch you guys next time peace